In this week's medical moment, we look at the heart. Tim Doty is checking in with Spectrum Health Medical Group to learn more about vascular screening and how it can help prevent issues down the road. Exercising, eating right, and eliminating smoking are all great ways to stay heart healthy, but it never hurts to get a vascular screening done. The biggest one that screening has probably been proven to help is with abdominal aortic aneurysms. And um, most would agree that if someone is over the age of 65 and has a family history, most of those societies agree that that person should have at least one screening ultrasound to see if they have an aneurysm. There are a lot of issues beyond the aortic aneurysm, and as Dr. Stefano Bordoli explains, an issue in one part of the body could signal a much more troubling overall problem. It's not just a problem of, let's say, that person's carotid artery. Um, it also means that they probably have blockage in other places, and where that's really important is that they probably have blockage in the heart, or at least have a reasonable increased risk of having blockage in the heart. So when someone has pain in the legs when they walk or they have carotid blockage, they should also be seen by either a cardiologist or their you know, internist should be kind of keeping an eye on their heart. Unlike some screenings we've discussed in the past, the vascular ones are just about as pain-free as you can get. Most screenings consist of a carotid artery ultrasound, so that's just an ultrasound of the neck looking for narrowing in the carotid artery, an ultrasound of the abdomen looking for an abdominal aneurysm. Um, generally doesn't hurt and then looking at the blood flow in the legs by blood pressure by the ultrasound so none of those really are painful none of those are having to stay in a small space like an MRI and feel claustrophobic they're all pretty pretty painless and the other good thing is that um, when the screening is done the patient gets a report card of their results and then that report card is also actually sent to their primary care physician so it's good continuity of care and good communication if you want to learn more about vascular health, Spectrum Health Medical Group is holding a Get Ready for Summer event April 28th at Calvin College. It's free and open to the public. Tim Doty, Fox 17 News. Still ahead, it's a prank that's getting millions of views online.